So my first class is actually math. Give me the rip. Oops. It's, it's happening on the Shumway Show. Here, there goes Brighton. Hi, Brighton. Cute jacket. So today, London is wearing a cute jacket from H&M and the cutest backpack from Walmart and some really cute pants also from H&M. Lexi is wearing a really cute shirt from Target mm -hmm. and some awesome pants from H&M and some shoes from the Converse store. Cute! Okay, love you guys. Love you. Day. Bye. Hi guys. Welcome to the Shumway Show. I am in the car because I am actually at my school right now. As you can probably see from the title of the video, we're doing... Come from... to school with me. <laughs> you guys are going to come to school with me and I'm so excited. We actually live out of boundaries from the school, but I love my school. So my parents are nice enough to drive me to my school every day. You know how that goes. We're always late because there's not a bus to just get me there on time. So every day we have to ride a late note. So my dad always writes funny late notes every morning. I try, I try. He tries, okay. This one says, Taylor's late for school. I told her it's not cool. Please excuse her tardy and we will throw a party. <laughs> I love it, dad. So some of you guys know, I actually have a really hard time with school. I don't get bullied or anything. I, just, I have really nice friends, but I don't know why. School's always just been hard for me, so. Good morning and just give my dad a hug. I love you, Taylor. <laughs> love you too. You're gonna do awesome. Thanks. Have a great <sighs> day, okay? And today's gonna be fun. Yeah. We're selling our house today, probably. That doesn't help. Life in a messy car. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye, love you. Bye, love you. So my first class is actually math. So I'm headed to math. I finished this worksheet, now to move on to the next one. This is Allie, you guys know Allie. <laughs> We're in the same math class together. So this is my math teacher, Miss Rude. Oh, it's Lincoln. And I love Miss Rude because she's so young and she makes math so fun. It's not like a boring with a boring old Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> You guys know that I got knee surgery and so I can't go upstairs. So we're in the elevator instead of going upstairs. This is Sarah. What's up? <laughs> we're advisory buddies. Okay, so we're in science and we're playing a mini game of pool. How cute this is. Here's my hand compared to it. It is so cute. So you try to hit the white one and then you try to make the white one hit the other ones and go to here. I don't know how to do this with a stick. <laughs> yeah, which one did you hit? I don't know. Let's see. Oh. Seven. I hit seven. You hit seven. So that's mine. Oh, wow. Okay. Which balls are mine? You have 11 through 15. Go, go, uh, go. This hit that, so it hits one of these. So you might want to come around here. <laughs> do you only get one hit? She's the expert. So funny. Okay, my turn. <laughs> There's a special way to I hold it. I think I'm gonna come around. So I'm gonna try to hit four. I have one of these. Oops. Oh, I got two. Oh yeah, I did it. So we're actually playing with a ping pong ball because it's science. So this is Mr. Jolly, he's my science teacher. Mr. Jolly, what is your favorite part about teaching science? Doing fun experiments like fun this. Experiments. We're your favorite class, right? Oh yeah, for sure. Good. <laughs> you actually, you're my best class, even though really? you're my biggest class. Yeah. Good, You're my Good. best behaved class. <laughs> Good. <laughs> so I'm in science now. He's my friend. There's my history notebook and I decorated it all cute. I love it. So we're at lunch now. This is my lunch. And I have a and some bell peppers. And some cheese. It's really gross. You guys know Jessica. Remember Jessica? And this is Ella. You guys remember Ella? This is Kate and this is Rachel. 
So we're here at lunch and we're playing Crazy Eight. Oh, it's my turn. I didn't even know that. So lunch is coming to an end and I'm headed to Fax. McKenna, where are you headed? Pier Tutor. She's headed to Pier Tutor. Ella, where are you headed? Sewing. Ella is headed to sewing. We're filming Sorry. here at Taylor's school. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> She's so cute. We're in our sewing class. This is what it looks like. Yeah, me and Reese are in the same facts class and it's awesome. Our teacher doesn't know we're filming so we have to be really quiet. <laughs> and we can't show the camera anywhere. We are doing aprons right now and it's super fun. And I love Taylor. Taylor's my best friend. I have a freeze. Aww. You're the best. <laughs> Not that it'll do anything. <laughs> it probably won't. <laughs> okay, so this is my fabric and it looks kind of crazy, but it's actually just like a floral and like a gold. And then I have like a gray purplish color to go with it. So we're making aprons. And so these are my two colors. And this is Reese's fabric. She has a plaid and then a yellow. Looking good. <laughs> My mom is here and she's looking good. Hi, mom. How's it going? Good. Good. How's school? School. Yeah. Did it school you? It was just school. <laughs> so we're here at the Radstone store just like we are after every day of school. After the rat swim store, we decided to come to the storage unit and our cousins are in town. What's up, guys? Whoa, holy crap, we're tall. Okay, so Michelle and I are here. We signed our documents to sell our house today, so it's pretty much like not ours anymore. Isn't that so sad? Yeah, it's And crazy. we're here just moving out a last few things. As you can see, we just have a TV over there. We've got some stuff in our cubbies. We've got our caramel colored couch. And we have some bar stools. Do you guys wanna see my super cute movie outfit? I know you're just dying to see it. So I <laughs> have on long socks. And then I was also wearing this beanie just to add to the full effect with the bun. What do you guys so think? Cute. Should I wear this more often? Yes, every day. <laughs> so what are you gonna miss most about our house? The view and the oh, people, our sure. friends that live across the street and all around. And a lot of things, when we bought the home, we always felt like it had a really good spirit about it. That's what Kyle and I both were like, this home just has a good feeling. Hopefully we can find another home that feels like that. Here it is, it's empty now. And it's kind of sad saying goodbye. Yeah, it is. But we're ready to say goodbye. We're just taking a little look at our master bedroom here. Before we walked up the door, I was like, I just want to come one more time and stand over here where this is where our bed was and just look at the view. The one thought that I had was I just felt like thanking Heavenly Father for the time that we had here. I feel really grateful that we had nine amazing years living in this home. So what a blessing that's been, and that's something that we'll always have, the memories living here. That's true, I'm so grateful I'm glad too. we have lots of vlogs of living here. So yeah. check out some of the old vlogs of like all the fun things, like Dude. the big Christmas tree we put in the living room. Thanksgiving and Christmas vlogs from two years ago are like irreplaceable to me. We had a Christmas tree that filled half this room. It went all the way from the floor to the ceiling. And uh, when I was decorating it, I fell off a ladder and I, <laughs> I almost died pretty much. And you guys, the tree was so tall. You'd like cast it into the ceiling. This light wasn't there then, it was a different light. But I remember it like rocked the light as it was going up and we were all screaming, ah, and it's on video. Yeah, because the top of the tree was all the way over here. Thank goodness And we had what? to fold it up and it scraped the ceiling. <laughs> and we had to like, I had to pin it. Look, you can still see the bolts I used because I screwed bolts in. 
right there. The buyers are probably gonna be bugged they didn't take those out, but I screwed those in and I had to like wire it so that it didn't tip over. We should tell them that's this report in case they decide to get a huge tall tree. Yeah, I should. Anyway, be sure to check out those vlogs. I'll link a couple of them below because they're so cool. Yeah. Okay. Be grateful for where you're at in life. You never know when it's gonna change. So if you just appreciate the things you have now, you'll have that forever, just the gratitude. It's true. Anyway. Here's the view that Michelle was talking about. Here's the view right here. Utah County, Utah Lake. So pretty crescent moon. Anyway. Okay. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, guys. Love you. Signing off. Love you.